What are we, what do we have today? This guy from the third floor, like George or something, he just got in a car accident outside. Just right outside. George? George, I don't know a George on the third floor. Me neither do I. What's happening? Apparently somebody from, um, I guess it's marketing is on the third floor, right? Third floor marketing and Somebody promotions. named George got in a car wreck. Wait, wait, what was his name? George. George from the third floor. He's That's a the bigger information guy. we have, yeah. We don't know if he's bigger or not. I've never met him, I don't know him. Wait, I know, I know him. Look, I just met him yesterday on the <gasps> elevator. Wait, really? Yeah, he's like a bigger guy, he's George from the third floor. Like, I, I, ju I just met him. This must be so hard for you. Wait, this is so crazy. Like, I just had a whole experience with him and now he's going to the hospital? This is crazy for you. You, this is, I mean, George is gonna be fine. He's got paramedics, but you, you are who this is about. Tonight, we're here with Stephanie Koenig, who knows somebody that something happened to. Steph, tell me, how is this affecting you? Well, it's crazy because, like, it just happened, and I did kind of know him. Uh, his name is George. Oh, my God. How are you dealing with the fame? It's too much. I've been getting all these, like, sponsor deals, right? Because I'm famous now. And it's like, I didn't know that, like, knowing this guy and, like, speaking up about his trauma would kind of create this kind of special thing that's happening right now. Well, I think that you take this moment with the press, you've been handling the press incredibly well, I think you become an advocate. It felt so silly walking into the elevator that Monday morning. It was a crisp, cool day, and George was standing there looking at me with sort of a, who are you, kind of look. I knew that something big had shifted. Mm. Something big in that elevator. Brian. Can I snag you for a second? Hold on, I'm just gonna talk to this guy for a second. What's up? Hey, I'm Brian. Um, one of the producers of the show. You know her, right? Her, Stephanie? What do you mean? Of course I know her. She's my she's one of my best friends. You're you're downplaying this. The fact that you know her means this is about you. And you have a right to to, to own that. Do you understand? This is about you now. No, no, no. I got an idea I think you're gonna like. I got a whole, I got a ghostwriter and retainer. I can help you. But what people didn't see behind the scenes, behind the podcasts and the news shows, was me, a friend, undervalued, cast aside. No, your book was great. I had no I, had I think your book was better in a lot of ways. Oh my God, George, uh, how are you? I'm sorry, uh, who are you two? Oh my god, um, it's, um, you remember me, Stephanie, from the elevator? George. She's <laughs> crazy. The uh, George! Uh, I'm, I'm so sorry, I don't uh, recognize you two. D sorry, we work with you. We're, we're, we're on the first floor, you're on the third floor. This is yeah. crazy. How are you since the accident? Don't you remember meeting me in the elevator? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. How, how, oh, sorry, I actually don't want to. kind of hurts a little bit. How are you? What happened? It, it ended up being nothing, just a little crink in the wrist, but I just want to have... A little bit of support for right now. Insurance covered it all, so it's pretty good. We just had the yeah. craziest thing. It was pretty crazy. We got so famous. 